The Bible says that if we confess our sins, He is faithful and just to forgive us and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. If all the dishonest folk would fess up. If all the sleepy members would wake up. If all the sleepy members would wake up. Sleeping in a dangerous time. If all the lukewarm Christians will follow what type of church would we have? If all the non-playing Christians would start playing, what type of team would we have? If all the gossipers would shut up, what type of army would we have? If all the real soldiers would stand up, what type of army would we have? The big end. The big end. I don't know about you, church, but I'm tired of folk telling me what they're going to do. Come on, Pastor. I'm looking for somebody to just go ahead and make it do it. Yeah. 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 They always put the if. If you give me a chance. Well, you got a chance now, and let's make it do what it do. Yeah. Uh, we don't need no more excuses. Come on. Uh, we need to just get up and start doing Well, you got an opportunity. Let's see what you're going to do with it. Yes. If, if, if I just had, brother pastor, a pair of shoes, I, 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 I would get there. Well, we done gave you some shoes now. What you going to do with them now? Yeah. Uh, brother pastor, yeah. <laughs> you could bless me with a church. Uh, I'll get there. We done gave you a shirt now. What you going to do with it? Pastor, if uh, you gave me some food, uh, I promise I'll get there. I'm preaching because we're doing all this. Uh, but I'm waiting for somebody to get off the big if and start doing something. Uh, we need to stop making excuses now. And, uh, get in God's business and start making it do what it do. It's time out for the if, amen. It's time out for us to make it work, amen. Uh, we got the equipment uh, to do the work, amen, but we got to be willing to work. Uh, uh, the Bible declares, amen, uh, the harvest is plentiful, uh, uh, but the labors are few. Uh, amen, it's time out for excuses, it's time to come up and work. Uh, it's time, amen, to make it work like God designed it to work. Uh, so, amen, we need folk that's going to be honest in God's army. Uh, we need folk that's going to tell the truth uh, in God's army. Uh, uh, when you mess up, you what? You fess up. <laughs> Amen. Nobody's going to put a gun to your head. Nobody has a, a heaven and hell to put you in. It's just we all are learning from our mistakes. <laughs> But when I find out, people are always trying to blame somebody else for their downfall. Uh, if Brother Snodgrass uh, hadn't got in my way, Brother Pastor, uh, I would have made it to the church meeting. Uh, if I didn't catch Brother Deacon Snowball uh, down at the gym joint, uh, I would be a better Christian. Uh, well, I stop by to tell you, that ain't going to work. Uh, amen. You're going to get rid of that excuse. Uh, amen. And start doing what God called you to do. Because all excuses been nailed to the cross. You know what I said? All excuses been nailed to the cross. I'm willing to go, God. But if, just like someone in the Bible says, let me go back home and bury my mama, that ain't going to work. I just bought a piece of land and I need to go back and take a tent to it. That ain't going to work. The Lord don't want to hear no more excuses. It's time to get up off your do-nothings yeah, yeah, and yeah. start doing something. Hey amen. Somebody need to get on the move for God. We are soldiers, amen. And we got the word of God to equip us for the battle. We need to quit making excuses now and start fighting 
this army. Yes. Amen. Lord, give us with truth yes. and put on the breastplate of righteousness we heard. Amen. Yes. And start going forth. Amen. Right. God will make a way. Yes. But we got to quit putting if on it. Yes. If, if this, yes. if that, yes. if this. Yes. Amen. Yes. Quit making excuses and start going. Yes. Amen. Yes. Yes. Come on, That's all right, brother. Right, right. Yes. Sir. Yes, sir. The big yes. Yes. Take, in other words, we got to start taking can't, even the word can't, start taking the word can't out of the cabinet letter. Come on. Because now we can do all things to Christ that strengthen us now. Amen. Now, now we're on the Lord's side, church. We are more than conquerors. Yes. You know what I mean? I said we are more than conquerors. Yes. Amen. We can take the city now. And then all we need some real soldiers that's really be some sanctified gangbangers. You don't hear me. Somebody that's down for the blood of Jesus. Somebody that's down for the battle. Somebody that's not scared to go and fight. Somebody not scared to die for what they believe in. And then I'm a soldier in the army of God. And I'm ready to fight, amen. To fight the good fight of faith. To lay hold on eternal life. And then we need to get rid of it. And start doing what God called to do. You can do it. You can make it. You are somebody. Yes. Yes. Give me that word out of your vocabulary. If I just had one more dollar, what you doing with the dollar you got? Come on, Pastor. Preach now. Preach. Y'all don't hear me this morning. Come on, Pastor. You don't have a whole bunch of dollars. Yes. All right. Can I get a witness? Yes, 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 Lord. yes sir. Amen. Amen. You ain't getting one more dollar. Yes. Use the dollar you already got. Y'all yes. yes. remember the story of the parable, right? The fire that Jesus left, the talents, and the money went. Yes. Amen. And one went and uh, made some more money with his, another made some more money. <laughs> but that bootleg rascal. <laughs> The one said, Lord, I knew you was a hard taskmaster. <laughs> and all this. he made an excuse. Yeah. 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 So to get it up and use what he had. Yeah. Uh -huh. Do y'all know a shoe was better than no shoe? Mismatch shoe was better. You gotta stop making excuses for certain stuff. And wake up. Man. Smell the coffee. Yeah. Church time is winding up. Some of us in here are still uh, dependent on the world system. <laughs> Y'all don't want to hear this, but I'm going to tell you, huh? where if they're soon to run out, yeah. you better get up and start making something happen in your own life. Yeah. <laughs> amen. Start quit making excuses. Amen. <laughs> amen. And get up and make something happen. Yeah. Opportunity is now. Yeah. Yeah. If somebody, how many can say there's one that somebody gave you a chance and you didn't do nothing with it? Uh -oh. yeah. amen. amen. I can. Opportunities don't knock all the time. No, they do not. You better make full advantage of what somebody's trying to bless you with and give you it right now because time is winding up. And when you start getting up in age, you're going to look back and say, I wish I would have. It's too late. Remember thy creator in the days of thy youth. Young folk, now is the time to serve the Lord. Yeah. Now is the time to run for Jesus. Yeah. Because if you get too old, you really can't do much for God. But now is the opportunity time to get up. Yeah. And make something happen. Yeah. Why? Because you got that fire in you. You got that zeal in you. You got that stamina in you. You can do it now. Amen. This is, young folk, this is your chance now to stand up for Jesus. Young folk, you don't have to sell dope. Young folk, you don't have to stand on the corner. This is your opportunity now. Make it happen. The big if. The big if. If I had a chance. You got a chance right now. You got a chance right now to give your life to Christ.